you should have accepted the offer instead. Then none of this would have happened here. Do it well, Sarah Polnikova. Sarah, is everything okay with you? Come with Sarah. I know where it goes out. Get away from here, guys. Oh no. They're gone. I messed it up. I messed it up. What happened here? Where is Mrs. Polnikova? Ah, uh, I can explain that, boss. It's not what it looks like. Well then explain, Mario. But now I'm excited. Mrs. Polnikova was not alone. Her friends were here. They helped her escape. What please? Our scourge is gone? Well, it's not completely gone. It's just that she's not here anymore. How could that happen? One of her friends surprised me from behind. What did he look like? To be honest, it wasn't him, it was her. You let yourself be beaten up by a woman. She snuck in from behind. I couldn't see anything. Suddenly I was hit by a foot. What should I have done? You should have been more careful, of course. Yes, boss, you're right. It's all my fault. I'm sorry. That shouldn't have happened. Yes, that shouldn't have happened. You're right about that. What's happening to me now? It's very easy, Mario. We can't afford to make any mistakes in our business. I know that, boss. I need you to fix this. Otherwise, we have no use for you anymore. What do you mean by that? You know that. Find Sarah Polnikova. And bring them to me. You know what else happens, right? Yes, I know it. I'll find Mrs. Polnikova. I hope so for you. You won't escape me this time. I'll find you. Are you really okay, Sarah? I can't believe you actually came. Without you, everything would have turned out differently. You're really friends for life. Especially you, Lisa. We would never let you down. That's what friends are for. I'll never forget that. If any of you need help at any point, come straight to me. I'll always be there for you. We'll always be here for you too, Sarah. What do we do now? Are you taking me home? Home. I'd say we're picking up right where we left off. That is also a good plan. So we're going to school? Exactly. I'll find you. You can't escape me. Let me think for a minute. If I was Sarah Polnikova, where would I go then? Back to my house maybe? No, that would be far too easy. To my friends? No, Sarah would never put her friends in danger. There is only one place you would go again. Where I found them the last time. Your old school. I'll find them there. Don't get excited too soon, Sarah. I'll have you soon. Okay, Sarah. We're back again. Do you feel safe? With you by my side, yes. I can't thank you enough, Lisa. You risked your life for me. You really are a real girlfriend. Sarah, of course. We'll always stick together. Where are the others? I think they've already gone in. I hope Mr. Coons is still here. I'm sure he's wondering where we are. It's best we go in and have a look. Yes, you're right. Let's go in. Hello, kids. 
Where were you then? I've been looking for you for an hour. It's a long story, Mr. Coons. There are a lot of things happening in this town. It sounds like you've had another adventure. Just like before. Isn't that wonderful? I don't know if you can call it an adventure. But yes, Sarah, and I make a good team. That is true. You've always been that. I've been a teacher for a very long time. But I've rarely seen friendships as strong as yours. Everyone should have a friend as good as you. Thank you, Mr. Coons. So can we finally start the party? Yes, let's celebrate. I'm almost there. The school is over there. Mrs. Polnikova must be there. I can't fail again. Otherwise, the boss won't forgive me. That must not happen. I'll find you, Sarah Polnikova. Even though it's the last thing I do. It should be here. It's Sarah's old school. I found them once before. I'll do it again. The tracks are still fresh. Sarah can't be far away. It's probably somewhere in the building. Okay, enough partying for today. The others are downstairs. I'll go to them for a minute. I haven't even talked to Jonas yet. All right, Mr. Coons. See you later. It must be here somewhere. It can't be that hard to find them. This school is huge. There are definitely 100 rooms. Anyway, I have to keep looking for them. I can't give up. Shall we go to the others too, Sarah? Yes, I'd love to. Lisa, I've been thinking about something. I'd like to give you a gift. For saving me. Oh, that's not necessary. Yes, I insist. I'd like to invite you to a vacation. You're welcome to bring your husband along. That's really nice of you. And where are we going? You can tell yourself. Wherever you want to go. I'll pay for everything. I am happy to accept the offer. So here you are. I've found you. You won't just escape this time. The boss wants to see you, Mrs. Polnikova. And you'll get a fine too. For kicking me. We can't waste any time. You're coming with me right now. Put your hands up and turn around. What is wrong with you guys? Are you hard of hearing or something? I think you'd better turn around, Mario. Huh? What do you mean? Oh no, not again. Leave my students alone right away. Lisa, Sarah, is everything okay with you? Mr. Coons, you saved us. You're not the only one with a black belt in karate, Lisa. I'll believe you right away. Come on, let's call the police. So that this criminal is finally jailed. What gift does Sarah give to Lisa? A. A car. B. An Erlau. C. A house.